Well, good evening, Kit Kats, and welcome back to Mist Hold. Um, I am super excited because, as you can see, there have been a few updates since we last played, and it has been quite a while since we played. So, um, I'm starting up here in town, um, so that way I can show you what has been going on. So, we got the first upgrade to uh, Nookling Junction, which is TNT Mart. Um, it's a great little place. Uh, definitely expanded on the amount of items that you can buy, as you can see. Um, so I'm just going to walk around once just to see what we have. You know, some weird little things. And one of the things I like is that there's more... You could purchase walls and stuff. Um, so, like... And the cool thing is, like, they'll show you. So it's like, oh, oh dang it. I didn't want to buy it. <laughs> I did not want to buy that. Oh, well. Um, too busy trying to explain things to you. <laughs> but, uh, so yeah, you can actually, like, look at stuff and they'll show you um, what it looks like. Which I think is fantastic. Whew. Sorry, I'm a little tired from work. Um, but yeah, so we can do that. Um, and also, they also have this little thing. It's the catalog, which you can go and, like, look at things that uh, have been, like, up for purchase here at the store. So... You know, you could just kind of buy all that kind of stuff, which I think is great. So it's like if you miss something that you didn't have the, the bells for, you can go back and uh, buy it. So I think that's really great. Um, and then also, I noticed this earlier, but we are actually getting the kicks, uh, which is a shoe store. So it should be built. In a little bit. I was trying to see if it'll tell you how long it's going to take. Um, but yeah, so we have kicks. Um, and we also have, uh, we don't officially have this yet, but um, it's going to be Club LOL where KK Slider can come and hang out and do all that fun stuff. Um, we do have a few villager changes, so we do not have, uh, Egbert anymore, the little chicken that was up in the corner. Um, also, our bridge is finished. It's so pretty. I love it. But yeah, um, the little, uh, chicken guy, rooster, that was up in this area, he has left Miss Told. So, which is kind of good because I would really like to put uh, Brewsters here whenever we get that uh, public work project. Um, and then, I don't know how I feel about her, but um, we have a new villager named Cat. And she lives in this little house. And she's out. I'm gonna try and find her real quick for you. But, um, can't make any promises. And we've also upgraded our house a little bit. We've added the fairy tale fence around the house. So that's really great. But yeah, uh, that's pretty much all the new things. Um, the only other new thing is the fact that we now have the access to the island. So we can go on the island and talk to Cap and go catch awesome rare bugs. Oh, I'm so sorry. I'm yawning so much. Like, please forgive me. But um, what we're actually going to do is I have my other DS set up right now. So, oh, what do you want to pay me for? Do not say you're leaving. Oh. Ooh, 
new nickname. What? Um, how about T Puff? <laughs> I like it. It's cute. <laughs> All right, so Marina is gonna call me T Puff, and I absolutely love it. Um, okay. So what we're gonna actually do is we're gonna go up to the train station, and let me see. My support says it. Valentine's Day, festival, fishing tourney. All these things okay yeah cool okay I know everything about that all right so what we're gonna go do is we're gonna go to the train station and I'm actually gonna unload some of my stuff that's in my pockets first um let's see I'm definitely gonna unload this because I'll sell that later I have a manhole cover? Really? <laughs> Alright. Put this... All the... Everything that's not a fossil up there. What else do I need to put up there? I think I'm good. Alright, so I have a lot of fossils and I want to try and see if uh, my other town needs any of them. So, all right, let's go talk to Booker, or Porter, sorry. Right. Ooh, uh, let me go open my town. <laughs> I'm actually, I have my DS on, on oh, my other DS, and uh, can't visit the town if my uh, gate is not open. Um... <laughs> So, let me just open, invite guests in, a nearby town, okay, saving, yeah, I would like to use the station. <laughs> <laughs> oh my gosh, I love that he called Isabel's distracted, so it's perfect. Alright, you won't need to show me your TPC. You need to have a really unique face. I mean, just look at that nose. Oh my god, rude. <laughs> Visiting another town. Go to a nearby town. Yes. All right. Looking for nearby towns. So the town we're actually going to go visit is called Barista. Um, this is my second Animal Crossing town. Um, because basically. I had abandoned my first town, which was called Gallifrey, I believe. I, I can't even remember. Um, <laughs> but uh, I had kind of abandoned it after a year, and I was like, oh my gosh, I don't want to go pull all those weeds, and, uh, you know. So... I actually uh, restarted it, got a whole new town, it's kind of great, um, I'm super excited that we're going to be able to see it. <laughs> Alright, have a safe trip, here we go. So this might take a little while to load, oh no, oh wow that was quick. Um, but yeah, as you can see, my town flag is a cup of coffee with latte art and stuff like that with a green Starbucks B on it. <laughs> and yes, I made this town when I was a barista at Starbucks, so don't hate. 
Um, all right. So we're here in Barista. And let me actually go see if my person is in town. Yes. All right. Well, this is my other villager. Um, her name is also Tawny. Uh, she is super adorable and I love her so much. Um, so basically what I'm going to go do first is I'm going to go to the museum and see if Blathers will let me uh, donate some stuff. So. Oh, I can't donate. Oh, so I'll have to give it to <laughs> the other Tawny. And, um, what you call it? Um, but actually, let me go check the floor on the top because if she has any of the silver uh, stuff, I'm definitely getting an yes, silver fishing rod. Yes. Yes, I would like it. <laughs> All right, let's go. All right, so what we're actually going to do is we're going to go visit the island um, on uh, Barista, in Barista, I should say. Um, but I just wanted to check other things. Yeah, everything's closed. Dang it. Except for um, the Able Sisters. I'll stay open a little bit later. Alright, so actually let me hand these fossils over to the other Tawny. And then we'll get going to the island. And also... Bummer. Okay, I think I need to actually come out of the station. And yes, it took me a bajillion and a half years to put these tiles down. It was insane. Put it around. Oh, okay. Well, fine. <laughs> And that's the reset center. All right. Do that for Tawny. So that way she can get a whole bunch of stuff. And wow, it's been forever since I've been in this town. <laughs> So basically, oh, okay, so I am super excited, but also super sad. Um, so this plot is for Lucky. Um, he's one of my dreamies in Mistold. He is this super adorable dog that's wrapped up like a mummy. And I freaking love him. And I'm going to try and steal him away from Barista because I need him in my life. All right. Um, and this is actually my house here. So, yes, very similar. All right, let's go. Alright, so um, another thing I'm going to be doing is I'm going to get a whole bunch of 
stuff. Don't run through the flowers, oh god. <laughs> Accidentally running through flowers, not a good thing. Alright, so let's get down here. There we go. I'm gathered at the dock. Okay. All right. That's everyone now. Yar, then to the deeps. <laughs> so, I think it's funny that Cap'n is a thing, um, because basically Cap'n is a Kappa who takes children from families. It's an old Japanese folk tale, and I think it's hilarious. Um, but yeah. So once we go to the island, we're gonna catch a few little rare bugs, and um, so what we're also gonna do is just hang out. Um, I should have showed you my island first, but, um, this is the aftermath, I guess you could say, of what, uh, is gonna eventually be my island, because, um, there's a hack to where you can catch other, uh, rare animal, like, rare bugs and stuff that are super, super rare, but also they are a lot of money so um, basically you cut down all your trees and your bushes beside your palm trees and you uh, you know you can catch these bugs after 7 p.m. Um, which is great because we're actually at like 8 o'clock ish so it's gonna be great I'm super excited. All right. So let's go. So this is the island, um, you know, not too much. Um, and then, so now we're gonna get onto the actual island. And um, so basically, let's do talk to Lloyd because Captain holds all your belongings. Um, so we're gonna get us a uh, net so we can catch some things. All right, and then we equip it and we start slowly walking around the island. <laughs> and uh, in order to do this, you just press A and um, this is the only thing. Like, I have the volume of the game technically muted. Don't tell me you're not gonna spawn bugs. I'm gonna be so mad if it doesn't spawn bugs because I'm visiting. Gosh. Okay, good. All right. So we're gonna slowly walk up to this. 
It's going to take me a few seconds. Because this is one of the, the bugs that is easily scared. So... You could tell how scared he is by the fact that he's not really moving. They scare very easily. So, we're going to do this. Right there. Turn. Walk up two steps. And got it. Whoa, I caught a golden stag. All right, sweet. I'm so glad it actually spawned a bug or two. Uh, Cause that's like literally the whole purpose of this island. <laughs> like you want to make some quick money. Um, let me catch this guy. Whoops. Thought I was close enough. Nope, dang it. Um, cause there's some bugs that I haven't caught yet on the island, so that's why I haven't completely destroyed mine yet. Oh, there's another one. So, um, but yeah, uh, cause there's a few bugs that are essentially missing from my encyclopedia. So, Cyclomatostag. Alright. Let's see. It's like I haven't caught, like, the wharf roach, which those appear no matter what. see how easily they scare a lot of these bugs scare really easily but that's why they cost so much I mean they don't cost a lot holy crud look at all the bugs yes ah it's okay <laughs> I should be looking at my actual DS screen and not the screen on my video capture because that's what's messing me up. Ah! Dang it! Oh, excuse me. <laughs> really? Really? I didn't think I was that close. The heck. Another common thing is to just straight up, like, get these little bugs, uh, like the tiger beetle. Just keep smacking the ground with your uh, net and they'll go away. And that'll leave. Because only... Because basically there's like an algorithm for uh, bug appearances and so y you have to have there's only so many spaces that bugs can appear at a certain time so ooh, wolf roach yeah got it Um, but yeah, there's like an algorithm on how many bugs can appear, uh, at a certain amount of time, um, not a certain amount of time, um, at a time. So you basically want to try and like scare off all the bugs that aren't the really expensive ones. Slow. 
so you don't scare them. Ah! Dang it! But yeah, like, a rule of thumb is like... Uh, oh! Dang it, I was going too fast. Um, is if they stop moving, you're being too loud and moving too fast. Um, luckily, there's a few of them that aren't really phased by this. So you could basically, you could, like, there's a few of them where you could literally, like, just run up to them and they'd be like, meh, whatever. But, like, the golden stag, like, that one you need to be, like, super quiet for. Ugh, dang it, too close. Um, you know, so... This is the Hercules beetle. Okay. Gotta kinda sneak up on it. Ah! Dang it! I am not having good luck with these bugs today. It's probably because y'all are watching me. <laughs> anyway, um, so that's pretty much the island. Um, which is great. All right, so let's go back to town. Um, and I can actually show you what my island looks like before we head out for the day. So I'm gonna sit here. Oh, yeah, I don't wanna sit down. I don't want to lose everything I just caught. <laughs> so let me put everything into here. All right, cool. So obviously I'm gonna go back later and go catch some more stuff. Um, let's see. Let's go home. Go home. Yes, I'm going back. Um, let's listen to no music. Okay. Ship bound for barista is deporting soon. Okay. Yay. And the cool thing about, like... Uh, saying you don't want music is the fact that, like, you could just basically go back to town. It's great. <laughs> um, and then another thing I'm going to do is... Okay. Cut all my effects. Grab everything from the pickup box. So, let me actually reorganize this. Of all the things that I need to go donate bottom close okay all right so i'm gonna bring tawny over here and so that way she can drop off a few things um because i'm not entirely sure if i have some of these in my town or not because she has a few items that i don't have i believe so pick that up pick that up up and then we're gonna also go to her house so that way I can go get some of her fruits actually let's just go straight to the train station 
because um, you can access the bags um, from the train station. I mean, not the bags, the what you call it, uh, your locker, I guess. All right. So while that's loading, let me go run to the hills. <laughs> Come. I'm so glad Lucky's moving in my town. Like, oh my gosh, you have no idea. It's so fantastic. Alright. So, I have baskets of fruit that I need to give myself. <laughs> so, that's what I'm going to do. Go grab this. Or actually, I just have one of each fruit. So, grab that. Coconut. That pear. Coconut. Grab a basket of perfect. Alright. Close. Alright, let's go back outside so I can drop these off for myself. Let's go over here. And we're going to drop these off. Put on ground. Put on ground. So that way I can actually have some good amount of fruit and everything. Um, so I can start planting things in my town and actually start getting money from, uh, everything. Because that's another way to make bells in this game is you, um, like you sell fruits and everything. Oh, oh no! Um, drop it. Okay, hold on. Oh no! <laughs> I wasn't expecting that. Okay. Um, I'm actually gonna bring the fossils back later. So, because I would rather get these fruits. Um, and have mangoes. have mangoes and pears and okay so uh, now I'm going to leave town and show you what the island looks like when you basically start so let's go talk to Porter Ooh, excuse me yep gotta go Looks like someone's leaving. Tony from Misthold is going home. <laughs> I think it's funny, like, apparently I'm already in the train on my other DS, but I'm not in the train right now. <laughs> and now I'm getting in the train on my DS, my, my main DS, which I think is hilarious. So we're saving, we're doing things, getting things done. <sighs> And welcome back to Mistold. All right, so I don't know why they don't just let you stop in the thing, because I would like to go uh, put these in my locker so that way I don't lose them. 
left, so that's what I'm gonna go do. Especially for the uh, the fruits. Put them on this one. Okay. All right. So first off, we're gonna go donate these bugs to um, the Misthold Museum. So we're gonna go do that, and then I'm gonna show you the island. Um, so let's go over here. And uh, next time we, we you come, I might actually have a different island <laughs> for one. But also, um, make a donation. Bugs, 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 bugs. Okay, confirm. I love how, like, if you give him one bug, he freaks out. And he's like, oh my god, bugs, bah! You know, but like, if you hand him multiples, he's just like, oh, thank you for the donation. We very much appreciate it. <laughs> and nothing else. Alright, so let's now go to the island. Do, 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 do. And hopefully by next time I film, I will actually have um, some paths laid down. I'm really surprised I haven't run into a cat yet because she was like all over town the other day. Oh, too far left. Oh, there she is. See that this is I don't I don't like her. Look at that. Um, let's see. She's weird. Let's see if I can get a little bit better view of her. Like her eyes are just weird. You know. Um. Okay. Yeah, you're not getting furniture. I'm gonna be mean to you because I want you to leave. <laughs> like, I know that's horrible, but it's true. I want her to leave. I don't like her. <laughs> Alright, thousand bells, yar. Oh, so that trip was 2,000. Oh my gosh. Okay, that's crazy. I didn't realize it was a thousand per person. I thought it was just like a thousand dollars, thousand bells, whatever. Like, no matter what, like, it was a thousand bells. I didn't realize it was a thousand bells per person. Like, OMG. <laughs> All right. But, um, it's funny, in my other town, I'm now picking up all the fossils. That was on the ground. <laughs> and I'm gonna go donate them to the museum. So, I, I kind of like these little songs that uh, Captain sings. But I found out the very hard way <laughs> that if you press... Uh, if you press A while he's singing too many times, he's like, oh, you don't like my singing? Well, fine. I'm not going to sing. So, meh. And I'm like, well, that's kind of rude. Well, I actually have all of those. Okay. Well, all the fossils that I donated 
um, they actually are already in my barista museum, so I don't even have to donate. So I'm just going to go back to my town later and go grab those fossils so I can actually get some more bells for my, um, for Mist Hold. So I could start on some pu more public works. Um, because one of the things I really like to do is, like, one, I like to get the second bridge in the town. And then I like to start laying down paths and stuff, but I haven't found a cute enough path that I like besides the one that I already have um, in Barista. So um, I'm going to go and do the thing. All right. So this is what your island looks like or what it kind of sort of looks like when you um, first get, in get your island. So let me grab a grab a net because I see some bugs on trees and I would like to catch them. So you usually have a lot of flowers, some hibiscus bushes, stuff like that. Um, ooh, I don't have that one. Yay, that's good. Um, but yeah, so you, you have a few little hibiscus bushes and stuff like that. You got your normal pine trees, um, your palm trees. Ooh, ooh, ooh come here. I need a hermit crab. <laughs> That's another thing. Hermit crabs just like randomly pop up anywhere. Um, but yeah, that's pretty much your. This is pretty much your island. Um, as you can see, I have coconuts instead of bananas, like Tawny has. Um, oops, I didn't see the bug on there. All right, so we're gonna go try and catch this other bug, and then I'm gonna think I'm gonna sign off. Um, so. Nope. I suck at catching bugs today. <laughs> I don't know why. Got it. Ooh, Horn Dynasty. I don't have that one either. Yay. But yeah, so basically once I catch all the bugs that are able to be caught um, on like certain flowers and trees, like the regular kind of trees like this one or the mango tree in the back, um, once I catch all the bugs that are able to be caught on those, I'm going to actually cut everything down, like take up all the flowers, sell them, you know, basically demolish a lot of the island. <laughs> and um, then it's just going to be the palm trees left and that's where the big bell bugs, the triple bees, are always located. Um, but yeah, so anytime after 7 is like the perfect time to do that so just letting you know let that bug go it gets scattered away um and there's also like there's a few little locusts that and uh praying mantis and stuff like that that like you gotta watch these flowers like super carefully because they blend in super well and i'm just like how I know they're like basically designed to do that, but it's just like, how do you blend in so well? Like, I don't appreciate this. You're a rare bug. <laughs> but yeah, so that's basically it. Um, that's all for now. I'm going to go catch this bug and I'm going to sign off. Oh, well, I'm not catching that bug. So, <laughs> but yeah. Um, so this has been real fun. I'm glad I got to show you my other town. Ooh, there's another bug. Um, I'm glad I got to show you my other town for a little bit. 
Um. Yay, I caught it. Um. So, uh, I think that will be about it, guys. Um. I thoroughly enjoyed having this little time with you, and, uh. Don't forget to rate, comment, follow, and subscribe to my channel for more playthroughs and also unboxings and random weekend vlogs. So I will see y'all later. Bye.